So just recently, I moved out to this new location. I made a video about this a while ago and doing that move from my old studio to this new studio was fun, but at the same time, a little scary because I had my MPC, uh, uh, MPC one, MPC Live Mark two, my 2000 XL. I had so many samplers that I'm lugging around and it's a little scary just putting them in boxes, hoping they're not being shaken too much. Well, you'll see right next to me, I have two analog cases uh, from analog cases and these are the two cases that I wish I had when I was doing that move right here I have this analog case for my SP 404 mark 2 my SP 404 mark 2 not just because I moved from one location to the other but the 404 mark 2 is not a sampler that I'm always using so I just have it in the side just in case I'm ready to use it but I noticed that it did collect a lot of dust even though I'm not mistreating it I have it in its own little cor corner uh, throughout some time it will collect some dust now that's just what happens in every room it doesn't matter if you have rug or floor dust gets collected throughout time so now being able to put my sp404 inside of the analog case it's nice and safe and i know if i have to put my gear somewhere safely i could just pile it on top of other stuff and it's not going to be harmed now right in the bottom i also have the mpc live mark ii case so it's fitted exactly the size for my mpc live mark ii now these are very expensive samplers and for me just seeing my 404 collecting dust was kind of freaking me out and i was like all right in the long run i need to put it away either in its original box or buy some type of cover for it because it's not just gonna break without me even using it. Now these cases are not made out of metal, so they're not gonna be very heavy. Uh, the outer shell, I'm not sure what uh, type of material this is, but they're very lightweight, but I feel like they could take a beating if you're gonna toss them around. Not that you would want to just throw your case anywhere with your sampler in it, but it feels like it will protect it from anything falling on top of it or just getting banged around. Now, the really cool thing about these cases is they're obviously hard cases, and you also have a latch right here on both sides that you could just uh, flick open and it will open up the actual case. Now, once you open up the cases, they are fully protected by the soft foam. Uh, you're pretty safe with your gear there's not gonna be banging around or just flying inside of the case it's nice fitted to the sampler that you're using it for not only do you have space for your sampler but as you can see you also have some space for your cables your chargers or anything else that you might want to fit on the side pockets right here now I'm a big believer in protecting your gear as you see right behind me I have this pelican case that I've actually had that pelican case for about four years and that is not for uh, recording gear or any of my samplers that's actually for all my video gear my cameras lenses i do a lot of video work so i'm going in and out of my house on the daily so i'm traveling with my camera stuff and you know camera gear is very expensive and it's not something i want to just toss in a, a backpack and hope for the best and let me tell you right now that that is the best investment i've ever made because all my lenses all my camera gear has stayed like brand new so just as i do for my camera gear i also want to do for my samplers even though i'm not going in and out as much now another really cool thing that i noticed is when you open it up you you will see some keys <laughs> that are inside i don't know how safe these are but i mean it's pretty cool that you get keys because my daughter as soon as she saw these cases non-stop she kept trying to open it and close it and she was just having fun with this so i was like okay i see what these are for i'm sure if somebody was to steal your case they're gonna get inside of it somehow but for if you have a lot of kids around the house and they just want to get inside of your studio you're gonna have a key make sure you lock it up now one thing that i should mention is that they have over 100 different cases in their website as a lot of cases it's not just for samplers but audio interfaces midi controllers mixers i also saw some interfaces for the apollo twins i know i carry some apollo interfaces myself uh the ableton push too there's a lot of different cases that you will find on their website so it's not just for the mpc and the sp404 so if you're somebody similar to me which i do have quite a few samplers 
I'm sure there's one or two samplers that you just have in the corner of your studio. I highly recommend you keep those saved. If not, get some type of cover. If not, put them in a safe case. Uh, go ahead and check out Analog Cases. I'll leave a link down in the description of this video. Uh, thank you so much for hanging out with me in this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'll catch y'all on our next video. Peace.